So when you find a dealer that is under comps on two card, two or more cards, stay at that table. Do your research at that table. Bundle together a deal with that dealer because to your point, when you find a reasonable dealer, they're going to be reasonable about everything because they're a reasonable person. When you find an unreasonable dealer about a couple of cards, they're going to be hard to make a deal with. Unless you have, unless the couple of unreasonable cards that they have are like big cards that they have more money in than like they can't afford to come down to you. But yes, I agree. 100%. And I have empathy for those people because I'm in that situation a lot. And a lot yeah. of times I have to tell people, look, I understand if you want to pass on this, I'm going to have to hold because I'm underwater on it so much. And I think it's, it's going to go back up to where I'll at least break even. So I'm going to hold. But I think that like, yeah. And to your point too, it could be that there's a like a, a, a really low pop card and the person just maybe they do like my Darius Garland Kaboom is a card that I've had out that I bought from Chase Krim, BGS 9.5.